All right. Let's get this thing, let's get this party started. <clears throat> Very close now. One minute away from the tournament started. I'm going to get my chat going over here. And less than a minute to Little Rock Chess is the number one team. We got six players. I don't know how we got to be number one. I don't know how they do that. A chat window. We have Book of the Week later tonight. 30 seconds away till the time for the tournament to start. Hopefully my audio and video are running okay. Um, just checking everything out. I think I'm in pretty good shape. It certainly looked like the audio is. Here we go. 10, 10 seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Zero. Waiting to be paired. Lemon Fist said he doesn't like the doesn't like the uh, format of the tournament. Top Lumpy Gator. He beat me the last two games. He has a six to five advantage over me. Twenty one eighty versus twenty one sixty five. here it's great when you're out of book on move three you're not constrained to, to play in any particular way I know I had this position not long ago, I remember looking at it afterwards. I think the computer wanted me to play e6 and says c6. If I remember right. <clears throat> wow. There's a move. I could play this, and when he trades, just take with the e pawn. Hey, turtle, can you hear me? I beat, beat an IEM in three check. I don't even know what three check is. I guess it means you give three checks in a row. <clears throat> You have three checks in a row, you win, huh? Whoa. What if I play here? I gotta watch this mouse. I tore it up playing Puzzle Rush. It doesn't work right. I don't know. <clears throat> He's taking his time. Which is, you know, that's the thing to do is to is to work on your game, try to figure out what is the best move. That's what it's all about. He is taking some time. And that's what he does. Now, if I take here, I really should take with a knight. 
if I take here, I mean, is he going to play this move? I kind of have my doubts that he would do that. But I don't know. If I take here, eventually I got to move it again. We'll do this. I could do this. Way back here, I assume he's going to play this move. I mean, I have to. I have to get in a break somewhere. Here. I don't think so. I kind of want to just do this. You know, that move, I just don't know about that move. Seems like it could be a little much, you know. But on the other hand, oh, wow. Well, that's a surprise. He traded the knight and then played F F four. Looks like this moves out. On the other hand, this moves never ever gonna work. Play here and here. Captures here though. Here, and then play here. I want to do this. I want to get off that diagonal. So when the time comes, I can I can actually do this. Captures, captures, captures. Are the queen captures? I still think this is a good move for him. And he does it. Maybe play here. I have the two bishops. I need to blow up on this position and get some stuff going. I can't believe he's doing this. It's kind of shocking. Well, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to play here and play here. That knight can't move here or here. This guy will finally have a diagonal. This guy will have something of a diagonal. I mean, I think he's thinking about this, but that's not going to do anything. Can he capture here? He can sack a piece for two pawns. Can he capture here? I don't think so. Okay, where is he going to put that knight? I guess he could sack. I don't really see how that's going to work. <clears throat> Bring 
this rook over. Right here. Another attacker on this square. Problem is my take there, he's gonna take like that. Which means he'll be fine. I have a little bit of trouble finding something to do here. Maybe here. I gotta be careful about pushing pawns in front of my king. I'm really bad about that. In here, then I can capture. Let's play here first. Puts a little added protection on that square and that one. And now I could capture where. Here or here. I don't really want to play his queen up here. I think this one. I'm going to try to take the e file. This can always go here. Queen takes and rook here, queen moves, and queen goes here. And I control the e file. I guess he's going to move his rook over and trade. Is that okay if I play here and he plays rook over if I check this king has to go here then what do I do rook here so when he trades I get a pawn here Also, let's see, is that how that works? I play here, he plays rook over. Play check, he goes here. If I trade, his queen's got the file. That's why I have to play rook here. Rook takes. Queen takes. I think that works. I hope it does. He might play there. I have to play here. Rook over. I'll lose my queen. I gotta be real careful here. He plays here. Oh, then I play queen here, check. I'm not even really sure that helps me that much. I'm probably push, pushing this too much. The 
No. Oh, he wants to trade queens. <laughs> Do I have anything better than trading queens? I want to play here. I can always take with the rook. I can always take with the rook. <clears throat> Monday team battle. Sorry about the chair. I'm going to do something about it someday. Whoa, he does that. Now what do I do? Um, okay, if I play here. I kind of need to have my king up there, don't I? I'm kind of tied down. Play here and then play here. This way we learn to deal with losing positions to be horrible at chess and end up in losing positions constantly. Thanks for the advice. Wish there was a way to <sighs> the moment of truth is approaching. Here take I take with the rook or the king. I take with the king. I have better king position. Can't get another piece on this thing. I could maneuver here to here and check. Maybe that's what I've got to do. What's he going to do? Check here? Check here? I mean, that's not a check. <laughs> that's not a check. He moves here or he moves here. What's he going to do? He's going to play here. I think that's what he's going to do. Uh, play here. I think so. I mean, I really do think I've got the, the better position. The problem is uh, figuring out how to win this if there's a win here. I probably have a slight advantage. I don't know. Maybe I have a little better than a slight advantage. I certainly got king position on him. You know? So. <clears throat> okay, if I check king away. Does that get me anything? This is his weak point, but getting to it is not easy. Check, king over. Huh. here I can't get the I can't move my rook anymore I can't advance it any further
That's the problem. Maybe I could do this. Make him make a move. I wish I was better at chess. That's all I want. <laughs> I know the feeling. Uh, I definitely know the feeling. Is he going to check me here? I move here. He could move his knight. Just get my kings right here. I don't know what to do. I don't know. I can't find a winning move here. I wondered if he'd do that. I move here. He plays. He can't play check. I may be able to trade off that piece. I'm running out of time. I got to find the right moves here. He's going to have to go here. <clears throat> now I can trade his knight, kick his rook, and win this pawn. He's going to get down here, though. Make him deal with that first. Certainly feels one to me. Check king up. Got the king cut off on the, the rank. This time factor is really getting under my nerves. <clears throat> Do I go here? Nope, I don't want to lose my pawn. checks me here. I have to come back. I think I'm going to give that pawn up. Now a really interesting question is do, do I have the technique to win this? And the answer is probably no. Oh, I go behind the pawn? I always thought you went to the first rank. Takes him four moves to...
I'm either going to draw or I'm going to win. I really don't want to draw this game. I know I was one. I don't think I can, I don't think I can beat him. <laughs> King here, he queens. King here, he queens. Oh, well, good game, Gator. What? This guy has the audacity to play on. There you go, dude. Win that one. <laughs> this guy beat me last time. I don't really quite remember how, but I remember that he beat me. I want to say there was something a little fishy about it. Go ahead, play the thingamajig. Then he plays bishop d7. He really likes to simplify, doesn't he? I know I had a win in there. I got a little low on time and kind of just freaked out. I like messing with them, you know, like that game where I maybe gone for lateral checks back to the first rank and then checking laterally. Maybe that was the way to do it. I don't know. I'm just not sure at all. I play here. Oh, he'll castle, won't he? And I could have this piece. If I play here and he captures. Then I end up with doubled F pawns. I'm going to double his C pawns. Guess he's gonna play here. I was just thinking about playing here and here. I really hate he's gonna 
push that F pawn on me. I guess I could play here. When he plays here, I could push. That doesn't look that great either. Play here, he could just kick it. Doesn't kick it if he plays here. I pushed and he kicks it then. I don't know. Know what the best plan is here. <laughs> what if I did something like this and then this? But right after that pawn, <clears throat> let's play this. It slows him down on that. This Akshad J, J. Kaneshkar, whatever his name is. Play a book of the week in a while. It's a classic. Here we are on move 12. As we battle Aksha Can Canisgar. <sighs> it's a little chilly here in Mississippi. Yeah. He really wants to play that move, doesn't he? Well, now this isn't such a great thing because that pawn's protected. But I'm thinking about this. He plays here. I'm going to play here. And trade. I don't know if it's good or not. I don't know. I don't know how to assess that position. If I play this move, he can always play here. I mean, without him playing f5. Well, he could do it with f5 too. Play here, play here, play here. What do I do then? Here and here? Looks like it. He really wanted to get that move in. Here. It's not so hot either, I don't think.
I don't know what to do. This is it. Try to blockade on that square. Um, check turn the corner B five. B five. I don't think I'm getting that much for this. Push. He pushes right here. He can't stop me from going in here. Why not? Oh, what the heck. I don't know. I don't know what I should do. Deep Geek is streaming. Deep Geek is the only one streaming. Pretty much always. Here. You're next. Play here. He captures. I play here. I fork the queen and the rook. He could play queen here. Knight takes rook. Bishop takes knight. Bishop here hits his queen. She has to move away. Or wherever. I would get give up a knight and two pawns for a rook. I think that can wait a move. I play here, he could play here. And when I capture, his queen could capture here. And I play here check, double up my pawns, which would be horrible. I could play here. I've still got this square. I own it. It stops a lot of his counterplay. Take, take, take. Yeah, let's play here. Dropping the knight in here next move. I'm down to two, 225. What are our standing is? Oh, I'm third on the team. Oh, well. My games always take forever because I take forever. I don't know. I mean, it was an interesting idea to play it this way. I'm not sure it was all that great. I may end up losing the e pawn, and who knows? It was an idea. Oh gosh, you gotta be kidding me! Okay, knight here. Bishop takes. Bishop takes. I suppose he's gonna move the rook up. Can 
then what do I do? In some ways, that epon is going to stop me from making progress. Because it's on the same color as my bishop. I want to do this anyway. Let's see what happens. Okay, he's going to play queen here. Gotta be kidding. I did not expect that move. If I push, take. Take, you still got to do something with the rook. And that gives me a minute to defend my e pawn. This move looks great. Severely restricts his pieces. His queen, I mean. He's going to have to trade. And then he's going to have to move his rook somewhere. Probably here. Oh, guess I'm wrong. Let's see. Take. Push rook up here. I want to put a rook behind this thing. I think this is the right rook to put behind it. I can trade the knight and win this pawn. I'm going to go ahead and do it. Check. Check. Feeling better about this game. I check, he goes there, and I push the pawn. Then my rook's coming to here. This looks like the way to do it. I play here. I play here. What, is, what does he do? Can't take the spawn. I think that's a win. I'm going to let him think about it. Maybe we ought to do Book of the Week. It is about that time, isn't it? Let's do Book of the Week. Book of the Week. Where is my screen? All right, Book of the Week. The Book of the Week is Art of Attack in Chess by Vladimir Vukovic. Vladimir Vukovic. An Everyman Chess book, at least it was when I got it. I don't know who publishes it now. Art of Attack and Chess uh, by Vladimir Vukovic. When I first went to the chess club 50 years ago, Fred Hopkins said there are two books you should read. I'd been going for a few weeks. He said there are two books you should read to get better at chess. And one of them was Reuben Fine, Art. Is it Art of the Middle? No, it wasn't Art of the Middle. Ruben Fine, The Middle Game of Chess. And the other one was this book. This book's all about attacks and themes and checkmating themes and this and that. Art of Attack and Chess by Vladimir Vukovic. 
One of the finest Czech's books ever written, The Art of Attack, has been transcribed into algebraic notation for the first time. In the revised edition of the, in, in this revised edition of the great classic, the author expounds both the basic principles and the most complex forms of attack on the king. And a study of the this is hard to read. A study of the masterpiece. A study of this master. These letters are like little tiny white letters on a red background. A study of this masterpiece will add power and brilliance to any chess enthusiast's play. And Art of Attack and Chess, Vladimir Vukovic. These are the chapter headings. Attack against the uncastled king. The attack on the king that has lost the right to castle. On castling and attacking the castle position in general. Mating patterns. Focal points. The classic bishop sacrifice, ranks, files, and diagonals in the attack on the castle king, pieces and pawns in the attack on the castle king, the attack on the fiend kettled and queenside castling positions, defending against the attack on the castle king, the phases of the attack on the castle king, the attack on the king as an integral part of the game. First edition, this would be in English. I'm sure this book was published in Russian or something before that. Uh, first edition in English was 1965. Art of Attack. Preface by John Nunn. Introduction, Basic Patterns of Mate. All this stuff. Attack of the Only Uncastled King. This book is thick. It's 352 pages. The last one with diagrams and stuff, 349. Here, I'll show you a little bit of this. See, it's got some words in it, too. That's from whatever chapter. The heavy pieces in the attack. See, it's not, it's not tons and tons and tons of analysis. Uh, this is a, a really good, I would say, class player book. I don't, I don't know if a, if a master would be interested in this book. Less usual mating patterns. There's all kinds of stuff in here. And a few games. Anyway, Art of Attack and Chess by Vladimir Vukovic. Book of the week this week. All right. That was great. Uh, now, back to the tournament. I wonder if, uh, is Tony on tonight? I haven't seen his name pop up. Book of the week. Art of Attack and Chess. I I hadn't even gained any rating points. Gosh. Go check the spelling on that. I just always like posting this to the chat just in case anybody is wondering what book of the week is. Art of the Attack in Chess by Vladimir Vukovic. Boom. Done. I wonder if anybody other than my usual buddies are interested in this. Well, let's get that guy out. Art of Attack and Chess by Vladimir Vukovic. I still remember Fred Hopkins suggesting that I read that book. WP, what does WP mean?
Can't believe none of the other guys in this tournament stream. You'd think they would. Take, 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 take. Knight here hits his queen. All he wants for Christmas is to be better at chess. And I'm telling you, isn't that the truth? We'd all like to be better at chess for sure. I just don't know if I can spend more time on it or not. I spend an awful lot of time. What if I play here and offer a trade of queens? I'll get the open A file. Who good is this guy? I didn't know I'd played him before. I'm 2 and 0. Could play here. Back this queen. Oh man, I got a long message here. Freshy GGKPE. No offer promotion of your channel, viewers, followers, views, chat box. The price is lower than any competitor. No, I don't think so. I can live with my small audience. I forgot to <clears throat> get a water. Uh, did I even get one rating point this tournament? I'm wondering. Here. Queen. Nope, not there. Queen here. Bishop here. Since the knight's here, he could go here. Here, captures, captures. Queen moves there. I could just castle. After this game, I'm going to get a water. Yes, I am. I was planning on dropping that bishop in on h6. This attack is actually not something to avoid, I mean, to uh, ignore. Check. All the way over to here. That's an idea. Play queen here after all that. Back these two. I could take here. He plays here, threatening mate. Then I play check. Take, take, take. Once I'm here, I can move this knight and guard this square. I'm going to take that. This is going to get a little messy for a minute, but I think I'll be all right.
There's your question, isn't it? Check what's and what I do. I'll put it here. He can he can't go here or here or here. He can't go here because of this piece, and he can't go here, and he can't go here. Man, Schleeman defense. That guy plays a lot of games. He's always saying, good game, good game, good game, good game. See it up there in the chat window all the time. This is only my third game. And he offers a queen trade. kind of have to do that. I grab a pawn. Uh oh. Nope. I gotta make sure that doesn't happen. I push here. Just think if I push here, I'm making a target. What I have to be careful about is like him castling, me doing nothing, and then he plays this. Captures, look over, check, come back, he mates me. I grab this pawn. Next move I play here. Make sure he doesn't have something he can do in that diagonal. I think. I think that's how this I play this. Hey Ostruck. Yo, sorry I'm late. I was winning. You missed book of the week. What's how are you doing? You played one game and you won it? Is that what you're saying? Or you were winning? Yep, that's what he's trying to do. I play here to blunt that diagonal right now. This is where I don't need to play too fast. Because a lot of times I'm playing too fast. Because he wants me to move that knight. Of 
while this game's going on. I'm, I'm plus two. I'm going to get my water. Sorry about the chair. To play there. I'm in the bathroom break. To play there. And then. Kind of do want to go there. He can sack if he wants. I don't care. <clears throat> Another Schlemmer defense game in the record books. Bundy team battle. I could reposition this knight here. Not really sure that does any good either. Could play here. Try to get rid of this guy. I don't want to do it this way because it weakens that pawn too much. This isn't so bad, I don't think. Take, take. I'd have to sit behind it. Or on the other hand, maybe I should just cool it and just hang out here for a while. Play a move like that, threaten this. He sure slowed down. I played there. This piece. Book of the week. Play here and get two pawns. Go here, here. Yeah. Check king here. Rook here, check. King can't go here, here, or here, or here, or here, or here. Here, here, he could go here. This allows me to pick off another pawn. That allows me to checkmate him. Good game.
Ostrich leading the tournament. 12 points. Floppy's got eight. Hogger's got seven. I've only got five. Four, two. So we are in third place. That's over ahead of Mosaic. That's great. It's Cat Coffee Castle in this mix. Where was that guy from? I'm not sure. Well, twenty four minutes time for one more game. How many people are in? There are only forty eight people in the tournament. There used to be like a hundred and fifty or two hundred or something. Not that many. It's like every time I play somebody, they're on the Mosaic team. <laughs> you know? That's kind of funny. They're all on Mosaic. Well, this is Ostrog playing top Lumpy Gator. Ostrog's rated 1900. Uh-oh. I got paired against somebody good again. Kingpin. Who's this guy? I've played him before. He's on Mosaic. Okay, do I play here? I think I do. You're getting me one game. Someone please beat me. Ha <laughs> ha. Dude, I wouldn't say that because you're going to probably get beat. Sad to see the numbers so low, but I'm glad we finally have more than three players. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. And thanks for recruiting so many guys. You really brought in through those Tuesday night things. You brought in a lot of new players. I think we can build this online team. I really do. Someday we'll win the tournament. First place. No idea. I'm just making moves. Yeah, for real. And you've got, you've found some really strong players. Could go here in Castle Queenside. I think I'm on Castle Queenside. All right. I'm going to play here. Is this dude going to do one of these things to me? Probably. I think that's what he's working on. move
I really hope he doesn't catch capture my bishop over here. Oh, he's going to capture my knight. Let's took away his best square. Right here. Well, right now I can play this. Drive him right back. I'm going to drive him back. I mean, what am I going to have playing this move? Anything? Come back to here. Make a piece that's not doing anything. I think I want to do this. Oops. Check. I think I'll castle first. Here he comes. I've got to do that. I don't have a choice. Watch out about this guy. I think this guy's going to have to go here this move. I think I should have played this move. Because then this move happens. All I did was give him away to trade his knight away. What he just did helped. Sure did. Monday team battle. Sorry about the squeaky chair. I'm going to get some WD-40. I can play here. Take rook takes. Here he's going to play here. That's one problem. Uh, here, knight moves. He's got this square. I don't like it. Here, right here. Where do I move? Here? Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to let him court me here. Huh. Surprising. I didn't really expect that. Push, capture, capture, bishop captures, check, bishop back. Bishop 
here. Pawn pushes. Queen here, check. I don't know. Boy, that really does look good, though. Push. If he can't, yeah, he's going to capture. I capture. Bishop captures. Check. King in the corner. Bishop here hitting his rook. It's just, it just looks like the right thing to do. If I play here right now, I could conceivably play that one. Which is ugly, but it kind of stops what I'm planning on doing. I really think this is the move. I'll lose a pawn, but I'm, this attack's pretty ferocious looking. Wow. I didn't expect that. Play here. I don't need to be moving so fast. Play Rook. The Queen, I'm threatening take. I'll take the Rook. Okay. Now. Rook takes, threatening that rook and that queen. Queen has no checks. She takes here, I take here, and I checkmate. Rook takes. If rook takes, bishop takes, and he can't capture. No, he can capture. It's just a simple trade, isn't it? Okay, what about queen here? He plays rook here. Play here. Getting a little too much activity for me on that, that line. Rook takes. Rook takes. Bishop takes. Queen takes. Check. King, queen back here. Take, take. Leaves me up a pawn in an end game. That's not very much. I 
guess I have to play here. I don't think it's the best move at all. Okay, Rook takes. It wasn't the best move. <laughs> Believe me. Let's see. Rook takes, queen takes, queen takes, rook takes. Let me figure out a way to lose this real quick. Yeah, I play here, he plays here. I gotta be a little careful because my pawns are so loose over here. I gotta be careful about losing them. Real careful. Here, here, here. Queen takes, bishop takes. If you push, well, this pawn's going to hang too. I mean, I don't see any point in not trading queens now because I'm I'm, I'm up a lot of material. I play here. I'm threatening a deep pawn, among other things. here and he hits here. Gotta be careful about that. I'm gonna figure out a way to lose this. Just give me a minute. Play here. Okay, now. Take here, he checks, I go to the second rank. I intended this actually, but instead of doing that, I'm doing this. Now I need to do something different. And one thing I need to do is watch my clock because I am getting low on time. I just hung that piece, didn't I? Now he's plus one. There's another check. Here and he comes to E2. That means I gotta go here. He's going to mate me. <laughs> Lovely. He sure is. He's going to checkmate me. He's got a mate in two. No, excuse me, a mate in three.
It's a draw, dude. Go ahead and pet me. Wow. What a turn of events. It's a puzzle rush. And I never find things on diagonals. Yeah, he missed it. He had a mate in three. Queenie two check, king over, rook. I believe he did. What am I even doing? Take his rook off. Like this. This is really amazing, isn't it? I am going to try to lose this game. That's right, baby. It's over. It is over. It's all over but the crying, as Tim Smith would say. Wow. What a comeback. Two minutes for the end of the tournament. Incredible. And Ostrock still outscored me. I finished with nine tournament points. What happened? What happened? Oh well. That's it. Two minutes left. Don't forget. Book of the week. Art of Attack in chess. I need to read it. Everyman Chess. Vladimir Vukovic. This is Everyman. I mean, I, I'm sure somebody bought them out and has published this book. You know, <laughs> were you watching that game floppy? That's funny. I mean, dude, the guy, I mean, he played queen a h1 check. I played king f2. Where was it? Oh, he had h2 check, I think. I played king f1, queen e2 check. I have to play king g1. I think he has rook takes g5 check. Yeah. And then he and and then he mates me, right? On G two. I mean Queen G two mate. I think it was a mate in three. I don't understand how he missed it. And then I had the puzzle rush. Here it is. Look at the week. Unbelievable. <laughs> Sorry about that. Unbelievable. <laughs> Winning the queen was beautiful. It was, wasn't it? That was really cute. I'm glad I found it. I mean, I always miss things on diagonals. I couldn't believe I found one. I mean, that was incredible. I actually found one for a change. You know? What is this? I can't even read it. The charge. Oh, is the tournament over? The tournament is over. Um, 
Well, you hear it make that noise at music. Does it play some music or something at the end? Well, Floppy, we'll have to look at some of these games on Friday. I do have one thing I want to show you on Friday from last week. And uh, I think there were two moves. One game had one move, and another one had another move that were, you know, I thought really interesting and educational. Anyway, that's the end for this week. Another one in the record books. Another book of the week. And another tournament. I guess I hope I won a few rating points tonight. How did how did you do oh I gotta show you moves my opponent missed that would have made me resign. So you had the same thing in your game? Man, I tell you, we're missing so much stuff. It's crazy. And that chess by Jason, trust me, the next time I play that guy, it's game on. Uh, I played pretty poorly tonight, but my scores were okay. Yeah, no kidding, man. Me too. I got to work on some tactics. Missing too much. Way too much. But where did we finish in the tournament? Third? We finished ahead of Mosaic. Hey, that's great. Yeah, tactics. You're going to have a brilliant game going, and then you just miss one move, and it's all over. Man, I cannot believe that guy didn't make me. You know, I was trying to figure out a way to simplify the game. And I, I knew that queen a5 move was, or no, queen a4 move was coming. I was like, he's going to be able to play queen a4 at some point in this position and attack my a pawn and my bishop. And then I went right into it, and it was bad. It was really bad. I started to just chuck the bishop. I thought I was going to have a deal where I could threaten a back rank mate. I was going to win the d pawn and win it all. It didn't happen. Oh, well. I'll see you guys on Friday night. It was fun. Who winners this week, though? Okay, dude. See you Friday. The rest of you? See you next Monday. Monday Team Battle. Monday Team Battle. <laughs> Bye.